Okay. Can you tell us about the history of your relationship? <laughs> Briefly. Okay. We started talking in the summer uh, when we met at a party. I uh, started talking heavily in October, hanging out. Uh, started low-key seeing each other for a couple of months. Asked her to be my girlfriend on Christmas, December 25th, obviously. Um, and now we're coming on to three months, which is... Looking good. Yeah. It's going strong. Yeah. <laughs> yeah <laughs> what is something that your partner does that you appreciate? I can appreciate his thoughtfulness and his, like, caring for others. He puts people before himself. It's cool. It's rare. And it's like, uh, it's like default for him, which is cool. Um, I appreciate the fact that she asks questions and generally likes to know the answers to the questions, like, from people. She'll, like, ask ask things and then she's like really good at like following up on it you know like she remembers like what she asked so she'll like ask like oh so how's like, oh, like this person out. doing yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. and it's like you, you don't like get that too often you know especially like new people okay what's your biggest pet peeve that the other does oh. pet peeve um let's hear it, let's hear it. <laughs> <laughs> Um, is it my farts? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. They don't really bother me. Mm. Hold on. Oh, fuck. Me. I'm not prepared. Go me over. Sure. <laughs> you have one ready? You're like. Oh, I have one ready. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Uh, ready. No, she's she's been better about. It. Oh, oh my god. Okay. You're right. Oh, you're going. Oh you're my god. god. You're going. So he says sorry when he doesn't have to. Oh my god. And I'm like, dude. She's gotten you don't on have my to say ass sorry. so like, about it. I'm like, yo, don't apologize. And then I almost say sorry for it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so glad I thought of that. Whew! <laughs> my, it used to be my puppy. She's gotten a lot better at it now, though. Um, she used to sleep in so late. Like, oh my god. would wake up at like 11 o'clock. Get up. And I'd be like awake at 8.30, 9 o'clock. I'm like... Dude, waiting for me. The <laughs> daylight is burning. Oh my god. <laughs> but she's gotten a lot better. She goes to sleep early now, like earlier than she used to. And she like waking gets up, up like around she'll text me around like nine thirty, ten o'clock. Like It's better. Yeah, she's got she's doing good. It's better. Okay. Proud of her. So all couples have disagreements. What are some things you guys disagree on? And explain. Oh. Huh. Disagree about. I can think of one thing, but I feel like there's probably something else that's like better mentioning. I don't know. What have we disagreed about? Being friends with exes. That's what I. That's what, that was what you're thinking. <laughs> this guy's no problem being like super close with his ex. Like it's chill. And like, I only disagree in the way because like that's just not the way. Uh, my life is... That's, like, the only thing I can really think of. Not with an argument, though. No, yeah, I was trying, like, trying to think of something what good. What else do you agree on? I don't know. We don't really, like... <sighs> We're new, though. Yeah. Mind I'm you. sure we'll find something. I don't know. I don't really... I don't... <laughs> but sex. What? <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Next question. Okay. Will you take it away? Okay. So I'm sure that you... <laughs> when you guys do have arguments, how do you resolve your arguments? Usually cuddling. We do a pretty decent job of, like, communicating. Like, when there's something wrong first, to avoid, like, arguments. Just because we both... Like, we've... Like... We've had an argument before, like, everyone does, like, but we're pretty good at, like, avoiding 90% of arguments just by, like, letting each other know, like, yo, this has been bugging me lately, like, you just can't I, I be want passive. you to, like, yeah, and you can't, like, just hold it in, like, and, like, no, really ex bad. expect, like, somebody, like, the other person to know, like, what's on your mind, so, like, we, we do a pretty good job, like, 
uh, being proactive and like communicating. Use your engine cuddles though. Yeah. Usually. Yeah. What are some of your favorite things to do together? Hmm. We like to listen to music together. Play zombies. Oh yeah, we play video games together. She'll we, even watch me play TK. We drink. All 45 minutes, dude. It's fucking crazy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> plus like the fucking 10 minutes it takes to like get the game going. Um, um, we drink. We like playing board games together. Well, yeah. Uh, that was like from the beginning. Yeah, that's kind of like what we like got started on. Like, like, we played Scrabble on Pilot Beat together like during a sunny day. Like, yeah. It's cute. Uh, sleep. Oh, we love to just, like, sleep. That's all I get sex. Yeah, sleep. Sex is great, though, too. Yeah. I want to, like, look at the camera. <laughs> 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 yeah. Um, what else, baby? Um, we I like to write. We like to write. Oh, yeah. We both, like, we... We've like, written some shit together. Yeah, like, we did this exercise where, like, we did one collab. of us writes, like, we draw a line and one of us writes a poem on the left side and then one of us writes a poem on the right side. And you read and it all read as it one. across, like... We've done a couple, one. like, collabs in our writing, write for each other. The second one was super good. That's the one that we framed, the one that I framed. It's beautiful. It's so beautiful. <laughs> um... <laughs> Okay, what do you think is the key to a lasting, loving relationship? Oh. Three things. Communication. First one. Trust. Communication. Sex. Ah, yeah, yeah. That's oh, what you that's penetration. <laughs> Communication and penetration. True. Communication in bed. Having a good sex life, you know. I would agree that is valuable. Yeah, no one. Yeah. I think like the thing about getting cool, like older and like uh, with your sex life is like you learn what you like and like you can communicate that with someone. When yeah, you're we, as we, tell, we tell each other like. Like as you know, I feel like when you're, when you're with someone, it's not just like a. I'm not just gonna fuck this person once. And, like. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 But you want it to be good, you know? So you gotta communicate in bed. Important. Yeah, which is like, I feel like we do that a lot. <laughs> yeah. We tell each other what we like. Definitely. Okay, so to conclude this interview, can you describe a few of the things you love most about each other? Oh my god. Oh god. Okay. <laughs> you go first. Do you want me to go first? Yeah. Okay. I love Jude Boy. He's very social. He can get along with anyone. He can like make a friend. He like made a friend. Like gets his tire fixed. Like yeah. Like uh, he can just like meet anyone and like be totally friendly. Like and I love that. Um, he's got a lot of love to give. Like just like give. Like mm -hmm. oh, it's just like he can just give and give. Yes, he can. He's let multiple people freeload at like the rental before. <laughs> people that care about him are the only ones that are like yo like. That give and take needs to be a little more. But if it was just Jude, no one would look out for him. Like, he would just give all day. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. I love so much about his name. The way he treats me. Um, he's very funny. You're getting me emotional. He's very funny. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Um, I like the... I love... Oh, shit. She's like... I love it. She's like super genuine, you know, like like what you see is what you get. Like she like she doesn't like try to like act like anybody else. She doesn't like try to like fucking like put up a front, like you know. Like she's I mean she's got like things that you don't know about her for sure, but like she's definitely like genuine, you know. Like you don't have to like question about like, yo, is she talking shit about me, you know? Like, 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 she's like super just like this is her, which is super cool. Um, another thing I love about her, she's like, uh, she's not afraid to like voice what she feels. Like if she thinks she's like being wronged, or like you know, like she, she's willing to like, like just put like, she's w willing to put her words out there, like, which is, you know, some people get like me. I can be like be a little shy about like how I feel about things, you know. Um, and then, like, 
another thing I love is that she likes to write. Like, that was, like, super, like, attractive to me because I was like, oh, I love to write. <laughs> so it was kind of like instant attraction for me. Like, we both write each other things and uh, read each like read to each other. Like, we both have multiple poems from each other, like, back and forth. Yeah. I would oh say, gosh. um, out of the six interviews we've done, you're the newest relationship, but you provided the most in-depth and unique. No way. And answers. heartfelt question, like uh-huh. answers. Really? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Maybe we should do like a follow-up interview in like, <laughs> <laughs> six, like three or four months. <laughs> like a few months. Like. So what are